Oh, things are indeed fabulous here in the ShopRite Tobacco Plus studios because right now on the Alan Michael Show here on 103.7 The Game, we are graced with the presence of the first ever Miss Money in the Bank, two-time, the woman who beat Charlotte Flair twice, the woman who beat Asuka twice, and the former SmackDown Live WWE Women's Champion. It is the Princess of Staten Island. Carmella. Good morning, Carmella. Good morning. That was such a fabulous introduction. Introduction. Let me just say. Thank you. I'm just trying to be fabulous here and live up to the standard. <laughs> What's with doing everything twice, Carmella? I don't know. I guess two's my lucky number. Things come in two, so I think it's only a matter of time before I become the two-time SmackDown Women's Champion. Oh no, I don't. I don't know about that. You're, you you have to sit and watch those two compete on Sunday Ugh. at Hell in a Cell. Boo! You didn't even lose that championship. I know. That's my first question: What's it, What's Sunday going to be like for you when you're watching Charlotte Flair and Becky Lynch fight for the championship you never lost? Um, I'm. I refuse to watch. You're not even gonna watch. I'm not gonna watch that match. I highly. It's doubt too that. painful. <laughs> it's too painful. Well, tonight SmackDown Live is at the Cajun Dome before Hell in a Cell on Sunday. It's all about tonight here in Lafayette. Carmella will be there. Will there be a celebration at the Cajun Dome tonight? I think everywhere I go is a celebration. If I'm being completely honest, uh, but I'm so excited for SmackDown Live tonight. All your favorite superstars will be there. You have AJ Styles, Shinsuke Nakamura, Daniel Bryan, Jeff Hardy. Everyone will be there. Charlotte Flair will be there, unfortunately, mm-hmm. and I will be there. Yeah. So, like you said, it will be a celebration, baby. It's a celebration, just like it is right now here on 103.7 The Game. It's never, it's never been as lit up in here. I feel like it's brighter. <laughs> it's lit right now. We are. Lit it, talking to Carmella Smackdown live at the Cajun Dome tonight. I have a question for you because you are uh, one of the prestigious competitors. I mean, you've done, you've made history. First ever yes. Miss Money in the Bank. And the second. And, and, and the second because you did it twice. And you cashed in successfully. So which is better, winning that ladder match or cashing in the briefcase? Oh, that's a, it's very close. I don't want to say cashing it in because I think there were a lot of people that doubted me that I would never become champion or that my cash in would be unsuccessful. And I don't think if you asked anyone about a year ago that I would beat Charlotte Flair, everyone would say, yeah, right. But it happened. Not it once, did. but twice. It did. And I probably would have been one of those people. <gasps> I admittedly am a you? big Charlotte Flair fan, but wow, what a hater! But no, you, hater. Pro- you proved me wrong, and I am now I am now a Carmella fan. Awesome! I will. I will well, good for you. I was, I'm glad you jumped on the bandwagon like I everybody did. else. Once I realized how freaking fabulous I am. Well, I am a bandwagon fan. I root for the <laughs> Lakers, and I and now I root for you. And you were you were with the Lakers. You were one of the great Lakers. I'd say the the, the best ever. And then it's Paula Abdul. Yes, you're number one. It goes one. me. Then Paula Abdul. And then they're going to put your, what would they put in the rafters for you? A jersey or your shoes? Oh, I think a pair of Jordans, maybe. Nice. Yes, (laughs) Carmella was with the Lake Show. And we know that on the Alan Michael Show, we love the Lake Show. Uh, Carmella did not get a championship ring, though. You no, were there the year the after. The year after the back-to-back, yeah. Uh, okay, that's but a That's okay. It was still fun. And you're, you, you root for, you're able to root for the Lakers, even though you grew up in Massachusetts, right? I did grow up in Massachusetts, but I'm not a big basketball I, – I wasn't a big basketball fan growing up. Um, but I knew that I wanted to be a part of the best NBA dancers, mm-hmm. and that's the Lakers. Yes. And then once I, I moved out there and I was obviously dancing for them, I fell in love with the organization and – there's nothing like a Laker game, can I just say? Uh-uh. It's unbelievable. It's like an entertainment experience. Speaking of that. Tonight. A- tonight. That's what that's at the a Cajun real Dome. entertainment That's experience. real entertainment. Um, doors open at 515, and the show goes live on the USA Network at 645. Tickets are still available, and uh, it's going to be a great time. You never know what's going to happen. Live television, I mean, it's, it's going to be a good time. It's going to be fabulous. Fabulous. Tonight, I think. And we have also Paige is in charge. I, I don't know. Ugh. She doesn't seem to be treating you too too well these days. I mean, on Sunday she has you sitting there not watching the championship match. Paige is such a hater yeah. because I was champion. She was jealous of that. But I will say, right now, to be a woman in the WWE is everything. Oh, my. Evolution the- pay-per-view. Thank you. We have the first ever all-women's pay-per-view on October 28th. It's going to be amazing. You know, we're breaking barriers left and right with, like you said, the first ever Miss Money in the Bank. We had the first Royal Rumble match. Renee Young last night became mm-hmm. the first ever amazing. full-time female commentator on Raw. So we're just, like I said, breaking barriers. And it's only it's a, it's about time the women have 
on the first ever all women pay per view. Finally, yes, the Evolution pay per view in October, and I'm sure you have something special planned oh, for that evening. It's going to be a celebration. I mean, that's come that's on, in the home, that's in the hometown, basically. <laughs> Long Prin- Island, yeah. Princess of Staten Island, just right over there. And you know what? I have one last question. My fiance said I had to ask you this one. She watches all the shows on E, and she wants to know when you and James Ellsworth are going to have a show on E called Total Mella. Oh, well, I'm totally open to Total Mella, but I don't think James Ellsworth will be involved. That's what I told her. I don't yeah, want to no, see him thank on the you. E channel. James is fired. James is long gone. I don't need him anymore. One I thing used Paige him. did correctly, I yes, think. Yes. I, I, I mean, it is what it is. Um, James did what he had to do. I did what I had to you do. Did. And move on to the next one. Yep. And that's <laughs> what you get to do right now because we know we, there's other people in the building wanting to talk to you. So we're going to let Carmella go. Smackdown Live tonight at the Cajun Dome. Go see her. Charlotte Flair will be there. Of course, Boo. AJ Styles, Becky Lynch. It is going to be fabulous. Carmella, thank you so much. Thanks for having me. Coming up next on the Alan Michael Show, back to the Hoodat chatting, but we're going to keep it fabulous and lit here on 1037 The Game. <laughs>